Like and subscribe right now, or you're going to have bad luck for the rest of the week. You guys must be tired of seeing scary sea creatures on this list, so here's a video that'll definitely make your day. No doubt the sea is full of terrifying animals. However, there are some that are extremely friendly and have the tendency to become man's best friend. From friendly sharks to the sea's most productive animal, here are 10 of the friendliest sea creatures. Number 10. Whale Shark I know, I know. You hear the word shark on a list of the friendliest sea creatures and you probably think we're trying to get you killed or something. But the whale shark is actually one of the most peaceful sharks on Earth. Yeah, that's a real thing. Every year, thousands of people swim with whale sharks, one of the biggest fish on the planet, and they all live to tell the tale. While we generally think of sharks as killing machines, the whale shark's diet is entirely made up of plankton and krill. They eat tons of it due to their diet being limited to microorganisms. There's absolutely no chance of humans being eaten or even hurt by these gentle giants. In fact, they seem to quite like humans and have become somewhat accustomed to swimming alongside us. That's kinda cute in a way, right? The whale shark sounds like an intimidating creature, but it's hard to find a more peaceful shark. Unless you're a bit of krill or plankton, you can rest assured these things won't have any interest in hurting you. Number 9. Sea Turtles Whether you see one on shore during sea turtle nesting season or from a boat during a fishing charter or a dolphin cruise, a visit from a sea turtle will put a smile on the face of any nature lover. This ancient and friendly marine species off the Gulf Coast have inhabited the world's oceans for more than 100 million years, developing long lifespans, underwater vision, and migration patterns that can take a traveling turtle thousands of miles at a time. While sea turtles are commonly encountered at aquariums, boat tours, or snorkeling excursions, it's best not to disturb them, even if one photobombs your picture. But it's also essential to give beach turtles plenty of space. The only time a sea turtle ventures onto the beach is to lay eggs, which is a very delicate process that should never be interrupted. Number 8. Sea Otters Between their cute fur-covered body to their ability to play and solve problems, the sea otter is one of the friendliest creatures living in the ocean. Similar to whales, the sea otter was hunted for hundreds of years. It wasn't until the 20th century that sea otters saw a massive spike in their population. After zoos started to bring sea otters in for exhibits, the public fell in love with these friendly animals. Sea otters are one of the smallest marine mammals, measuring at about 4 feet long. While they are descendants of the weasel family, they're also the heaviest members, weighing in from 50 to 100 pounds. As with some sea creatures, sea otters are intelligent. Many otters love to dine on clams and other shelled animals of the ocean. Since they don't have the strength to break the shells, many otters will store rocks under their arms as they hunt to break the shells open. There are actually otters that hunt on crocodiles, but that's a topic for another video. Number 7. Manta Ray If you think dolphins are the smartest creatures in the sea, then you probably haven't heard of this amazing sea animal. These aquatic giants have larger brains than other fish species, with extensive learning, problem solving, and communication sections. Manta rays can also have brains that are up to 10 times larger than those found in whale sharks. Despite the latter being the biggest fish underwater, manta ray intelligence shows itself in a variety of ways. For one, mantas are playful. They love flying, and you can see the whole schools jumping together at dawn and dusk. These creatures also get very curious about humans. They interact and play with them on purpose. Plus, new research claims that giant manta rays can recognize their reflection. These strange-looking creatures aren't afraid to slide up close to shore and say hi. Unlike stingrays, they don't have stingers. You still don't want to touch them, though, because the protective membranes on their bodies can fall off when they come into contact with humans. They have to worry about us, not the other way around. So be kind and don't try to pet them. Number 6. Bottlenose Dolphin Need we say more? The bottlenose dolphin is one of the most beloved and popular sea creatures in the world, known for its fierce intelligence and appealing charisma. And of course, they're incredibly friendly to humans. So in summary, we love them. There are hundreds of places around the world that offer the chance to swim with dolphins, and just about everybody that does will tell you how wonderful an experience it is. These animals are so kind and empathetic that it makes the whole experience worthwhile. Even their curved mouths are almost designed to look like a friendly and permanent smile. What else could you possibly want from one of the most affectionate animals living in the ocean? Right? Number 5. Manatee There's a chance you've heard of this animal or have seen it on the internet, but maybe you didn't know the name. 
The Florida manatee is one of two subspecies of manatees found in the Americas. While primarily found in central and north Florida freshwater estuaries, the Florida manatee can survive in brackish and pure saltwater, leading them to destinations throughout the Gulf of Mexico and as far north as New England. Be aware that manatees are a threatened species. This gentle giant species are known to present a kind demeanor and are omnivores, dining primarily on seagrass and other marine plant life. Manatees are affectionately nicknamed sea cows for their large size, slow moving actions, and friendly disposition. While swimming with manatees is considered a rewarding experience, it is best not to bother or crowd a wandering manatee or manatee aggregation. Not only are they easily frightened, but they also tend to heavily defecate where they hang out. That's not very nice, but we'll allow it for this cutie. Number 4. Basking Shark The basking shark is the second largest fish in the ocean, after the whale shark. It's also the most weird looking shark out there. Its maximum size is thought to be at least 32 feet long. The basking shark's common name derives from its habit of feeding at the surface, appearing to be basking in the warmer water there. It has anatomical adaptations for filter feeding, such as a greatly enlarged mouth and highly developed gill rakers. They weigh between 6,600 and 13,000 pounds. Despite their large size and threatening appearance, basking sharks aren't aggressive and are harmless to divers and snorkelers, just like whale sharks. And even though they're large and slow, these sharks can breach, jumping entirely out of the water. Due to their passive temperament, basking sharks have the smallest weight to brain ratio of any shark. These sharks were once overexploited for their fins, liver oil, and as a source of food for humans and feed for livestock. This has led to a decrease in population, and now they're endangered. Number 3. Beluga Whales Beluga whales are native to the Arctic and subarctic and are uniquely adapted to the cold waters. Belugas were actually the first type of whale to be kept in captivity, with the first being shown at Barnum's Museum in New York in 1861. To this day, they're still the most commonly seen animal in marine parks across North America, Europe, and Asia, mainly because they're much smaller species of whale and easier to contain. They tend to be a hit with visitors because of their unusual color and wide range of facial expressions. Belugas are really curious about the people who visit them, and they often perform in shows with trainers with whom they develop deep bonds. Since 1992, it's been forbidden to capture belugas in Canada because of concerns for the population in the wild. So now most of them come from Russia. They're so popular that each one can cost as much as $100,000. Whale watching tours are a great way to see them in their natural habitat, but it's important for the boat not to get too close because it can interrupt their daily activities. Number 2. The Palau Jellyfish it's been made pretty clear to us that jellyfish are amongst some of the most terrifying sea creatures on the planet. One sting from the most unassies can spring immense pain. However, the Palau jellyfish are built differently because of their unique environment. This Pacific saltwater lake is a bit of a head scratcher, to say the least. Located on an uninhabited rock island just off the coast of Karor and Palau, a place known as Jellyfish Lake has become an oceanic enigma. Inside is one of the most condensed habits of jellyfish that were speculated to have been trapped there over 120,000 years ago, at the end of the last ice age. These jellyfish haven't evolved to grow stingers, and instead they exist like some giant beautiful lava lamp out in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. The Palau jellyfish are a beautiful sight to behold and thankfully, risk-free. Number 1. Sea Salps This one may take a few of you by surprise, given the fact that these strange, unassuming creatures aren't exactly responsive in the first place. However, one thing is for certain, salps, which are otherwise considered a species of plankton, are amongst the most expressive species on the planet, and without their sacrifice, the very nature of the seven seas would be at risk. Although they look like a mysterious alien-like ball of goo, Sea salps are remarkable creatures, as well as eating a huge variety of planktonic organisms ranging from bacteria to small animals, sea salps are among the fastest growing animals on earth, essentially becoming the perfect all-you-can-eat buffet for other sea creatures. Most importantly though, sea salps are responsible for sinking a huge amount of carbon dioxide, effectively absorbing the dangerous gas similar to trees. Without them, our planet may well be doomed already. So. Thank you, Sea Salps. Which one of these animals do you think is the friendliest? Let us know in the comments. And if you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.